Hey guys, Rebecca Austin here, and I'm here to show you another amazing tip inside Kajabi. Now, Kajabi is an amazing platform for offering online training courses and programs to your audience. And in most cases, the end user is the one purchasing the course. Sometimes, however, you may want to offer the option for someone to buy your program as a gift, or you can do a buy one, get one free, or a buy one, get one 50% off, that kind of thing. And it's very doable inside Kajabi. So let's walk through the steps. Now in Kajabi, in order to create a gift certificate or voucher type of system, what we want to do is first find our offer that we're giving as a gift, and then we're going to clone it because we have different automations. If someone purchases this offer, they are immediately granted access, and then potentially you may have automations on generating email sequences and all of those kind of things. So what we want to do, however, is still get the email sequences once they um, are in the program, but instead of it being going to the purchaser, we want it to all go to the person who redeems a coupon. So what we do is we go in first, find our offer, and we're going to clone it. So now we have our cloned offer. This will be the original offer that someone purchases and then gets all of those emails. This is the one that we are going to adjust so that it is the, uh, will generate a coupon and then the coupon bearer is the one who gets all of the automations. So let's jump on in here and make our changes. So the first step is we want to change our internal name so that it is reflective of this is the gift option. Then we want to take the product off. Now you can leave the product here if it's a buy one, get one free type of scenario, but if you are doing it as a gift certificate or voucher only, we want to make sure we take the product off. If you don't take this off, then the person purchasing is also gonna get access to the product. Then what we can do is click Save to make sure that all of these changes have been saved and we go into our checkout. The checkout can then be customized specifically with wording around not only the bullets of what they get when they purchase this program, but we can also change it to where it's reflective of the fact that this is a gift. So we can then change our title to um, something along the lines of So instead of it overcoming their fear for this particular program, it's help a loved one overcome fear. And then we can actually then also go into the body and we can add an image of a gift. Um, and then also we wanna include wording in here along the lines of when you purchase, you will receive an automated email that has a coupon voucher that you can forward to the person who is getting this gift. So you just change your wording inside this to make it very clear to the person purchasing what to expect next and how they're going to give the gift. Once you've made those changes, then you click save. And now we have our gift offer ready to go for the most part, but before we go next, we need to go back to offers and we're going to select coupons. Now we need to create a new coupon and make sure it's a single coupon code. From here, we can set this up as whatever coupon code you want. Make sure that it's a percentage off and then change this to 100%. We want it to be a um, duration of once. And then if you're going to do a valid through, you can include that, although because it's a gift, most of the time you wanna leave that blank. Then we click save. From here, we select the offer that we want to include with this coupon. And that's where we can find it much easier because we added our gift option to the offer title. And then we have our coupon set up. 
So at this point, then we go back to our offers. We find our gift option. And this is where then we're going to set the automations of what is going to happen when someone purchases this. So when they purchase, instead of getting the product, they're now going to add automation. We're going to send a single use coupon, find our coupon that we just created for our 100% off, and then you can edit the email that they will receive. So instead of, we can change this to get gift voucher for you and then adjust this to include your branding, your images. We can put some gift images in here, some really cool graphics to go along with this, make it look really super cool and professional. Add your wording with instructions that goes along with for the person who's received the gift. And now you have your gift certificate option completely set up. Once someone redeems the coupon, they will then get all the automations that you have set up inside the program once the offer is purchased. So inside your email, another thing you want to make sure you include is the link to the checkout page, which is the original checkout page, not the gift certificate checkout page. So we'll have a link where they can go to that checkout page, insert the coupon, and then be directed to all the automations that go with the prog program itself. The way you get that is we go back to our original offer and we click here for get link. Copy that, then go back to our gift. We go to our automation and edit it. And then you can actually do a button where we go here, put the link here, make this new window, change your color to whatever color that you want it to be, or if your brand um, colors, you can do that and then click OK. And then we now have a button on here um, to redeem the coupon, which will take them directly to their checkout page. Then click save and you're all set. Now the next thing to do is to promote your coupon. And the way you do that is you want to click up here, get link, and then you can use that link in your call to action buttons, put that on your sales page, put it in your social media, share it in emails, creating various, um, promotions to be able to let your audience know that they can purchase this program that you have as a gift.